Well, it is very appalling that a country that has failed to provide security to the people it governs is embarking on a suicide mission of criminalizing ransom payment by helpless victims. This was a submission of the chairman of the Nigerian Bar Association section on public interest and development law, NBA Spital Monday Ubani, during a press conference held in Lagos. Plus TV News correspondent Love Ikuko Yedeko tells us more in this report. This press conference was to herald the NBA Spidel Annual Conference stated for 22nd to 26th May 2022 in Sokoto State. But the convener and chairman of NBA Spidel, Barista Monde Ubani, took a leave from the event to comment on what he calls urgent national issues. He took a swipe at the Senate for attempting to criminalize payment of ransom to kidnappers to free victims. MBA Speeder condemns unequivocally the attempt by our national legislators to criminalize ransom payment by victims of kidnapping without tackling the root cause of kidnapping in the first place. Law ought to reflect reality in any given society. The truth of the matter is that victims of kidnapping pay ransom out of desperation and abject helplessness, knowing fully well that the state has failed and is unable to protect lives and property or secure the release of their loved ones from the kidnappers then. Barista Ubani said the piece of legislation under contemplation lacks logic and wisdom calling on the House of Representatives to jettison the bill without any further consideration. It is very appalling, therefore, that the same country that has failed to provide security to the people it governs is embarking on a suicide mission of criminalizing ransom payment by the very victims that are helpless and desperate to save the lives of their loved ones. It does not make any sense at all. Instead, the legislature is strongly advised to focus our laws that will strengthen national security and protection of lives and properties, assuming that there is a lacuna. The Nigerian Senate on Wednesday, the 27th of April 2022, passed a bill imposing jail terms of at least 15 years for paying a ransom to free someone who has been kidnapped. The upper legislative chamber also made the crime of abduction punishable by death in cases where victims die in life imprisonment in other cases. Okweyemi Bamidele, chairman of the Senate Judiciary, Human Rights and Legal Committee, told the Senate on Wednesday that making ransom payment punishable with lengthy jail sentences will discourage the rising speed of kidnapping and abduction for ransom in Nigeria which is fast spreading across the country. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Oyedukum, Plus TV News. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.